Election day is just around the corner. Actually, it's November 5th, but you don't have to wait until then to cast your ballot. Early voting begins Monday, October 21st and ends November 1st, according to the El Paso County Elections Department. There are more than 500,000 registered voters in the county. Now, voters can vote at any early voting location. To find a voting site in your neighborhood, visit epcountyvotes.com. The general election includes a race for president as well as state and local races such as mayor and six city council seats. Also on the ballot is the future of the Multipurpose Performing Arts and Entertainment Center, known as the MPC. Voters will decide to either revoke or keep moving forward on funding the project. You will recall that the, the center was proposed in 2012 and the voters voted in favor of that project. So 12 years later, what the council is now requesting is to ask the, the public once again, is this still a project that you want us to move forward with? And the ballot language is either for or against. If the public doesn't want the project to continue forward, then you vote for the proposition, which means that you're revoking the authority to issue the debt. If you want the project to move forward, you would move, you would vote against the ballot proposition, and then the council would be able to continue to build the project. The city hosted nine community meetings to educate voters about the MPC to include the language on that ballot. Informational postcards have also been sent and info has been shared on social media. To learn more, visit ElPasoTexas.gov slash MPC ballot measure.